On February the 12th, the superintendent of Davison Community Schools, Dr. Robert Hahn, announced his retirement after 13 years of work at Davison. So I took a journey to the administration building to meet with Dr. Hahn. I sat down with him, hoping to gather some information about his past and his plans for the future. But before all of that, I learned about Dr. Hahn's personal life. I'm uh, married and have two boys. Uh, one is 28 uh, years old. Uh, he's, he is uh, an attorney in Columbus, Ohio. And uh, then I have another boy who is 25, and he is director of electronic publications. He's the webmaster for NYU in New York City, and they both are married. Dr. Hahn has led a wonderful career full of excitement, changes, and many accomplishments. But how long has it taken him to accumulate such a fabulous resume? Well, my entire career from the day I started teaching in January of 1969 up to now has been just a little bit over 33 years. As much of the elite class, Dr. Hahn had to take a few steps before reaching the top of the mountain. It all started with a few words from a friend. When a friend of mine uh, told me that in Genesee County, Michigan, uh, they had a big need uh, for teachers. I had a big need for money. Uh, so I uh, applied for a job in the Kersley schools and they accepted me as a, as a teacher. Kersley was the first stop. Han taught at the elementary and high school levels before becoming an administrator at Kersley. Then I went to Linden and for nine years I was the middle school principal there before I became superintendent of Linden Schools. And uh, after being in Linden for four years, then I moved to Davison in 1989, and I've been here now for, um, well, this will be th my 13th year. Dr. Hahn doesn't like to gloat, so obviously when he was asked about his greatest accomplishment, he gave credit to others. What I guess I would say I will remember is the work I've done both here and in Linden uh, at at um, improving the curricular program, improving instruction for uh, students, improving the range of, of uh, academic opportunities for uh, the students that I was working with when I was in the middle school or when I was a superintendent of Linden or um, actually for the longest period of time uh, when I've, since I've been here in Davis. And I Dr. Hahn's achievements have been community accomplishments, but in truth, Hahn has his own wall of fame. He is a Davison Hall of Fame inductee, president of the Genesee County Superintendent Association, and he has won the Outstanding Service Award for Kiwanis. So the question everyone wants to know, what's next? Exotic vacations, family get-togethers, or just laying back and relaxing? My wife says that um, uh, I still need to be getting up at 7 o'clock in the morning with her next year, and so I don't think I'm going to be doing anything very exotic. Even though his career is over at Davison, he still might continue teaching at a higher level. But as for Davison, he is done, and many people are going to miss him. I just want to wish Dr. Hahn um, good luck in his new endeavors and to thank him for the positive impact that he's had on this community, the students, and the parents. Excellent communication skills. He's been a good leader, good positive man in the community. Good guy to have around, and I'm sorry to see he's retiring. In the short time I've worked for Davison Schools, I've seen Dr. Hahn's standard of excellence. He's got a great rapport with the community, and I wish him the best of luck in his retirement. He's been a great leader and someone that's been great to work for. I wish him a lot of luck. I know his successor, Mr. Perkins, is going to do a wonderful job. As we know, Mr. Clay Perkins, the current assistant superintendent, will do a fabulous job. He is up to the task at hand. We wish them both the best of luck in the future one ending a fabulous career, and the other about to begin one. Dr. Hahn will say goodbye to Davison along with this year's senior class at graduation. It has been a wonderful ride. Thank you for everything you have accomplished. Neil DeVries, DTV News.